What's up guys? Welcome back to Food Delivery Stories. Hope you're having a great day. Um, take a second before we start and hit that subscribe button for your boy. I'm moving on up in the world. Blessed. Today's Saturday. Didn't feel like working today. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Didn't feel like working. I'm out here parked by CVS. I'm gonna get a few Zoas to take to the house. Um, I gotta clean the inside of the vehicle, vacuum it. Give me one second, there's an order. I don't feel like shopping. I don't mind picking up, but wow. A Pizza Hut for $2.25 for 3.4 miles. Pizza bag recommended. There's no tip on there. And I know how people, you know, everybody's different with the no tip, no trip stuff. But I mean, that's that's bad. You know, it's, it's not like it's going across the street or something. That's going almost three and a half miles. But anyway, I didn't feel like working today. I damn sure don't feel like shopping unless a good one comes up. It's a little afternoon and just one of those days I'm just not feeling it. I feel like going to the house and chilling. Now they're throwing me a dunk in here. Seven dollars, three miles. That's not so bad. Even though Dunkin' takes forever, but it's noon, so we'll see what's up. We'll grab that one. Like I said, I just feel like just picking up and dropping off. Um, <clears throat> so let's talk about the week so far. The week's been pretty good for me. Obviously, you know I work nights, you know, 6 to 8.30 or 6 to 9 or whatever. So it's been pretty good, nothing too crazy. But it's been a good week. I'm consistent with my numbers. A lot of people in this area say, it's slow, but I've noticed one thing about DoorDash is that a lot of drivers are not driving. I'm not running into no drivers, um, especially during the week. It's like, I pick it up at places, they're telling me, can you take this one with you? I'm like, I can't. They didn't give it to me. I'm not allowed to, um, you know, go get it, you know? So this order is 11, wow, 11 items. <laughs> From Dunkin', that's gonna take forever. But like I said, we're just chilling. We're not really trying to be in a hurry today. My gas is low, so it's, it's you could say it's like a gas day. You gotta put money, you gotta fill up your tank type of day. So I'm just chilling. So let's go pick this up. I'll come back and keep talking to you guys and um, see how long this takes. This is a lot of crap. So I just reminded myself why I don't pick up from Duncan. Um, they have some good workers. There was one good worker there. She's nice. She does DoorDash too, I believe. But <clears throat> so they, I got the drinks, and then the person Turn gives right me the bag. Boulevard, then right Sorry. Onto Faye Boulevard. And then um, the person gives me the bag with like the breakfast sandwiches and stuff, and says, "Have a good day." I says, "Everything there?" She's like, "Yeah." I'm like, "So you put the donuts inside with the, all the hot stuff, the breakfast bacon and stuff? Oh, what kind of donuts were they?" I'm like. They don't even look at the um, receipt, I guess. Um, most of them always look mad. Like, bro, if you don't like your job, leave. That's what I used to do. There were some jobs I didn't like, I would just leave. There's a lot of jobs hiring. But anyway, so she gave me the donuts. I don't think they had the donuts she, she wanted, so they put something else in there. I have no idea what's going on. Um, horrible experience. I ran a pickup from the morning time there with the morning crew. Um, I don't know what was going on today. <laughs> I think this is letting me know, hey, you need to go home type of situation. So we gotta drop this off and come back and see, um, see if we get another order. Um, there was a Instacart order, $42. It was a triple batch, but it was going like 20 miles. And there was a, a lot of batches, so it was crazy. So a customer just texted me, I let them know about the donuts. So I'm gonna I'm a voice text back and we'll be right back guys. So we dropped it off, let the customer know, hey, you know, they didn't have this. They put something else in your bag. They just gave me a greasy small bag full of stuff. It wasn't even organized right. It was like brown bags you get from the liquor store. <laughs> so she's like, it's fine. We'll go through the habit, something, you know, whatever. I'm like, yeah, I apologize for that. So yeah, Duncan has one strike. It's uh, three strikes you're out with me, you know? Uh, that's how Burger King got there. I don't pick up from Burger King in this area, the one that's here, no matter how much it is, I don't pick up from there. Every time I go to Burger King, it's an attitude problem, every single time, always has an issue, always says ready for pickup, and then they, they put my ticket to the side and lead me to the end. 
so I don't pick up from them at all. Not saying I wouldn't pick up from no Burger Kings. I'll try new ones that I've never been to, but that one's definitely never being picked up from. So, it says Baywood 13, a breakfast spot, it's a hot spot. We're going back to CVS to get the Zoas, so pretty much I want to be done today. I'm like, that Dunkin' order just, you know, let me know, hey, you know what, you should stay home. Uh, plus, I want to relax. You know, it's just you know, it's just one of those days, drivers. You know how you know how it gets. Drivers out there, you know how it gets when you're out here. You're just not feeling it, and I'm just not feeling it. I'm definitely not feeling shopping. I know that. I don't mind picking up while I did the Zoa or something, but I definitely don't feel like shopping today. So, we'll get back to you guys. See if I got another order. I just got my Zora and went home. All right. So this sealed it for me. We got a McDonald's going back to where I live. The actual, a few streets away from me. That's a sign for me, it's done. It's a wrap, it's a six dollar order. It's three miles, so it's a wrap. You know, it's over with. And we gotta see what it do. So, somebody's calling me. We're gonna see what it do, we're gonna go to the house and chill. I'm not even getting my Zoa, I'm just leaving. I'm going to the house. Uh, don't forget to subscribe button guys. I know this was a weird video today. I guess that's just how I'm feeling. I'm having one of those days. I apologize. So uh, hit the subscribe button. Hit the bell. Do what you do. I appreciate you guys. We're at 520 subscribers. I appreciate you. Gotta get my views up. And um, yeah, I'm gonna keep providing content for you guys. And today was just one of those days. God bless.